In this video, we'll go through exam questions that cover the entry two criteria, recognize and sequence odd and even numbers up to 100. You can locate the questions on the mysmaths.com website under entry two. The questions are from different exam boards. We'll start with the non-calculated questions and then we'll move to the calculated questions. Let's start with the first question, which happens to be from NCFE. Ruby opens the library. The door is opened with a code. The code is the first four even numbers in order. Write down the next two numbers. So we've got two, four. What's the next number and the number after? So you've got to imagine there being three here. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If you don't need the support of these numbers, you can leave them out, so not write them. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, and so on. These are called even numbers. Three, five, seven, nine, eleven, and so on. They're called odd numbers. Jay lives at number 27 Cross Street. Some of the house numbers are missing. The house numbers go up in sequence. Tick the house where Jay lives. So we've got 13, then 15, 17, next will be 19, then 21, 23, 25, 27, 29. Again, if you struggle with this, you can put the numbers that come right after here in the middle. So 13, and then you can put 14 here to help you remember. Then 15, 16, 17, 18, 20 here, and so on. However, it's good practice to know how to count in twos. We've got to tick the house where Jay lives, and that is number 27. So that is this one here. What number comes next in this list? We've got 63, 65, 67, 69. So what will come after that? That's going to be 71. Because we count in, in twos each time, as you can see. So 63 and 2 makes 65. And 2 makes 67. And 2 makes 69. And 2 makes 71. So if you struggle to make this jump here, you can do 69, 70, and then 71. What is the next number in the sequence? So we've got 86, 84, 82, 80. What do you notice? We're going down. We're counting backwards. We're taking away 2. So that's 86. If you take away 2, gives you 84. So 84, take away 2, gives you 82. Take away 2, gives you 80. Take away 2, what does that give you? Gives you 70. Eight. So eighty going backwards. Then we have seventy nine and then seventy eight. What number comes next in this list? Sixty three, sixty five, sixty seven, sixty nine, seventy one. Again, we add in 2 each time, so from 69 we're going to 70, and then 71. What number comes next in this list again? We've got 82, 
84, so we add in 2, then add in another 2 to go to 86, 2 more to go to 88, and then 2 more to go to 90. So 88, 89, 90. Now we've got the calculator questions. However, you don't necessarily need to use a calculator. It's just there if you need to use it. A row of parking spaces has odd numbers. 23, 25, 27. What is the next odd number? Show your answer in the box below. So we're going from 23 to 25. So we add in 2, and then from 25 to 27, we add in 2. So if we add 2 to 27, we're going to get 29. Lee gets a leaflet about saving water. Leaflets go to these postcodes. Tick the postcodes with odd numbers. CR8. 8, that's even. CR9, 9, that is odd. 10 is even. 11 is odd. 12 is even. The houses on this side of the road all have odd numbers. Fill in the other house numbers. So we've got 21, 23, the next one will be 25, then 27, 29, 31. Again, feel free to write these numbers in the middle if it helps you at all. And this is the end of the questions.